morning, everybody. It's Mary Kay with Mary Kay's Artful Journey. Oh, you guys, you don't know what I've been working on. Oh, my goodness. Craziness. I'll show you in a second. Let me just get my chat up here and chat up, chat up. That <laughs> sounds like chat up. Chat up, chat up. Um. Clean all this off. So, I decided to go through my um, bag of stuff for my um, floral journal and see what I had in there and see what I can incorporate into my floral journal so and I found a whole bunch of um, you know uh, junk mail envelopes in my in my living room so I decided to work on these envelopes let me see here And then I would put them into my journal. And they can go either in the floral journal or the um, other journal. Hey, Mary Lou. How are you today? So, I like I was saying just a moment ago, I was going through my little stash of stuff for my floral journal. And then I found some envelopes to decorate. So, this guy's getting really full. But it still has a lot of pages left on it. A lot of places to put stuff, so... Lots of pages to put stuff. So, I was decorating. I'm good. I was decorating the envelopes with stuff. And then I also put some things in there. Like this one is all recipes on lavender. Well, actually, there's minestrone soup with rosemary pesto and and then there's um spinach spinach and fresh oregano pizza mozzarella marinated with herbs so this would actually go into the garden book rather than the um floral book they're kind of similar huh Oh, cool. Did you try folding him? And then it says plant a mint Italian herb garden. So you'd have basil, chives, fennel, oregano, parsley, rosemary, and thyme. I thought it had some other recipes. And then it has um, herbs that heal. And I thought that was really cool. Eight healing herbs. Anise. Um, boil two teaspoons of crushed anise seed in a cup of water and strain. Use either as a mouthwash or a s to suppress coughing and get rid of phlegm. I know, pizza and beer. I love beer. I hope you're not drinking Corona, though. <laughs> I love that with lime. And then it says chamomile German. That one, I think. Oh, it helps with digestive. A stronger infusion into tooth. 
Oh, helps with insomnia. So I knew that about chamomile. And horsehound is a cough syrup. And oh yeah, because you get the horsehound um, cough drops. And lovage, lovidicidum officinated. I've never heard of that one, lovage. And mint. It helps with abdominal pain. Chewing on a st mint stem and leaves controls the breath. If you have chapped hands, soak them in spearmint tea for relief. Oh, good to know. Rose hips. Stinging nettles. Ooh. What are they? Stinging nettles have been valued. For econs, <laughs> they're high nutritional content. The room, rheumatoid disease. Recommended by the Rumor Disease Foundation. Huh. We suggest that arthritic sufferers are aided by ingesting. Hmm. Oh, mint is good for the sinus. You know, I have some, um, I have some peppermint right here, and I, it's, um, 100%, and I just open it up and breathe it in. <laughs> I've had that since I had mice. You know, you have to have it for the mice. So anyway, so that has some great information. And then I just stuck it in here. So that'll go into my gardening journal. And I put this on this side. So what I'm going to do is put something on there. Hey, Jade. How are you? And so then I was decorating envelopes. So I got all these envelopes that I decorated. I thought that's a good way to use up your stuff. Oh, I you I have eucalyptus too. Oh, in a oh, in a, your diffuser. I have a diffuser. I haven't ever used it. I probably should use it, but I'm worried about my cat. Isn't that pretty? I like this one too. I like the basket. And then this one. So all of these are ready to go in the journal. In the journals, I should say. And then I put some in a journal. I found this journal that I did. I didn't remember doing it. But it's um, from an envelope, so there's a pocket here. And I was using my, up all my stickers. And um, trying to make use of them. And so I made some envelopes here and so here's a pocket here and then there's another one so there's your visual there's your visual and then another pocket here and then this is another envelope that I decorated and I decorated on this side there's a pocket I should have made the pocket on the other side but you know oh well and then this one there's a pocket here. That's what I was going to do is make it easier to get into. And then there's a pocket here. And then there's a, like a little... Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's the best thing is going through your stash and seeing what you got. And then there's like a little tuck spot right there. And then this. And 
You know, if I make it to a thousand subscribers, maybe I should give away a, a journal. <laughs> I have so many. <laughs> Look, I have this one. I have the floral one. Oh. I have the floral one. Okay, I'm going to take all of these out of it. I have the floral one, and then I have... Oh, where are they at? These two little ones. I have these two little ones. Welcome, Carolyn. So I have this one. So there's one, and then so, and then this one. This one still needs more stuff in it. It has a lot though, but and then I have my garden, my garden book. My fairy garden book. Look, I found these little little fairies. And then I love this. This is so cool. Look at all the little envelopes. I need to make another one of those. Oh, and then I found this. It's a um fairy gardens are rich with possibilities. Fairy figures purchased at a craft store n needed a home, and a friend had wanted to create twig houses. So, oh my, that's, oh my, what a house it was. It was made of twigs and eucalyptus bark and leaves and moss and pine cones, and for windows there was cobwebs. And so, then they have sources, plant with fairy names and it's Bloom River Garden so it has a different sources where to get products for fairy gardens. We have one right here in Tacoma. Oh that's cool. Well I have a almost blank journal. And then I have my grateful journal, and I have my vegan journal, and I have this journal. Remember this journal I made? This one doesn't have a lot in it. Put together in a kit. But it'd be nice to have about a thousand subscribers so I could just go through YouTube to do my recording. So there's a nice big one too. And look look what it's on. Look at the the cover is like a reorder cardstock. <laughs> the things we use to make our journals is crazy. Oh, and I need to make another journal because I want to do what is this? Hold on. C-A- how you're always making um, places to put stuff. So look, here's some more, there's some Christmas stuff. 
There's some more flowers and See, I need to make a nature journal, too. Oh, look, it's Winnie the Pooh. Okay, so I have a Winnie the Pooh um, book that I want to do. For, you know, um, look, and this is felt. Ooh, that one's pretty, too. Oh, look at all these pieces. More of that. That'd be good for your hearts, Mary Lou. Oh, look, and here's a tag. Oh, that was for the kitty one. <laughs> Oops. My friend. There we go. I'm going to throw that in the grub hub. That's pretty. Okay, what are all these? Oh, with these. Oh, that's a telephone. I'm going to put these in that box. I'll put them in there right now. Ooh, look at those. Those would be good in the floral journal. And some paper in the nature journal. Oh, in the floral journal. More floral journal. Oh, for the toilet. <laughs> oh, look, here's a here's a book. Here's a piece of here's a book cover. Ooh, that's pretty. All right. I'm just just kind of gandering through this just to see what it is. There's a lot of good pieces in here calendar. Oh look, there's even a little book. Dan the Digger Man. See, I need to I need to let go some of these things. I need to sell them. I need to sell some of my wares. Oh, well, here's a bag. Some envelopes and cards. And the 16 chapels, I don't know what that is. And look, some stickers from Christmas time. Some more kitty stickers. I just got so much stuff. Look, here's a pocket. Alright, we gotta put this in, in something. Alright, what's this? Believe. I believe in the all right, I just want to see what's in. Oh, here's a bicycle. Somebody was working on a bicycle journal. Who's that? Because <laughs> I think I was gathering stuff for their bicycle journal. Or maybe I need to make a bicycle journal because I don't know who wanted a bicycle journal. Oh, there's another floral thing. Gosh. There, I just got stuff in all different places. It's crazy. See, look. Oh, so these are like old-timey people. But look. Look at all these bicycles. So there's a bicycle there. That's a car. That's a person. Strip. Oh, look, they're all on bicycles. There's a wedding, a little people's wedding. Out of focus on half the stuff? I'm sorry. I just have a... a, a Can you see it now? Is it looks better focused, huh? There's a guy it's on the other side. Oh, a taller guy. <laughs> a big foot. I think that I think that's that guy that lived up on the lake up at um 
up by Mount St. Helens. There's the Ladies' Society. I'm just kidding. I don't know. Nice old timey pictures. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a mo it's a motor car race. You can see that. Well, would I put it up on Etsy or where would I put it up on? Maybe Facebook. Look, there's a train. There's a steam engine versus the other engine. Well, I never thought about that making themed kits. That might be a plan to get rid of some of my stash. The army folk. Look at that guy. A mom and her kids. Post toasties. Boy, that guy looks crazy. See, so here's another bicycle. And then look what I got down here I found. Let's see, is it in this one? Bicycle stamp. So I'm back. Sorry for the unfocusedness on half the stuff. Um, I know. I'm gonna go back in here and take all of this stuff. Oh, those are the bikes. I like this because my, my street is Montgomery. <laughs> it says Montgomery Ward. I just thought that was cool. Smith Brothers. Smith Brothers is a, it says that they're cough drops, but there's a Smith Brothers dairy in our town. Not a handsome fellow. You think Facebook would be best? That's what I was thinking is Facebook. Alright, so we're going to move this. I thought I was going to send this Believe one to somebody. Nope, it's just empty. Believe. Believe in the Father. There's a recipe thing. I need to put a recipe on that. There's a cat. Cat thing. Let's see this part here. I'm going to put it in here. Oh wait, there's a B one in there. B a B. I want to take this B one and put it in in my thing here for my bees. Bees and bicycles, bicycles and bees. Put it in my tin. Alright, so then 
Now I wonder if I should just get an envelope. Oh look, and here's another journal that I put into a into a bag. Yeah, now's the time to sell your journals because your um, you know, because everybody wants to document this event or whatever. Edith Holden reimagines. Edith Holden was a lady I wanted to remember because I wanted to try to find one of her books. All right, so we're going to put the bicycles in here. Isn't that a cool bag? It's nice and thick. And tall enough to fit the bicycles. Look at that guy. He looks like he's in his jammies. Ooh, and it just fits. Barely. Oh, that would be fun. Or maybe I just should send out Happy Meal. You can't see. Can you see now? Okay, I'm going to get these big envelopes over here and fill these up real quick. Hold on one moment. Ooh. Dang, I can't reach them. I need one of those claw reaching things. All right. You know what I'm going to do? This stuff, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put it back. We're going to put it in here. all of this. I'm just going to put it back in here. And we are going to get an envelope. Where's an envelope? I guess I can't use that one because I covered it. Here's a big envelope. So, I want to keep that because it has my Edith Holden on it. Now, I have a ton of envelopes here, so I'm just going to start um, filling envelopes, I think. I wonder if this guy will fit. He will. I'm just going to clip off his feet. Clip off his hat, head. How many people do I have in my group? <laughs> you have an Edith Holden book? You would, Jade? That would be awesome. Well, I have this book. 
Jade, I have this book for you. For your Christmas thing. So we'll do a trade. See, this one has the elves and stuff in it. I don't, can you see it? Hi, Tammy! And it has Santa's, Santa loves a good joke. He must, he tells the same ones over and over again. I just got back from a yearly flight around the world. Boy, am my arms tired. After I left home, I wrote my mother that I had grown another foot. So she knit me another sock. Let me tell you about ice nymphs. One, once three nymphs were sleeping in a bed. It was so crowded that one got out and slept on the floor. After a while, one of the nymphs said to one of, on the other floor, You ought to get back into bed with us. There's lots more room now. <laughs> Once the nymphs were out playing football, one of the players asked the coach to flood the field so he could go in as a sub. He fell back to sleep. That's all good. So, yeah, so this is a, um, this author is called, um, Lith Stewart Inc. is the, this is a first edition, all rights reserved. Oh, it's by Al Alden Perks. And he did all the drawings. And stuff. So it's a really cool book. Hey, Yvette. How are you? Long time no see. I'm going to put that in your, your Christmas bag. I'm just filling envelopes right now because I got a lot of stuff. Oh, you guys got to see this. I found this the other day. I'm going to put this back over here. I know. It's like you open it up, get it out, and then you put it back. What was I going to show you? <laughs> brain dead. Oh, I just had a brain fart. I'm making up some Happy Meal. Hmm. What was I going to show you? Oh, I, I found it. I found it. Isn't this cool? I think I've showed you this before, but... You know what this lady, who, she reminds me of? She reminds me of... Um... Oh, I'm sorry, Vet, that you've had a horrible year. I think we're all in the same boat, though, don't you? <laughs> um, she reminds me of... Oh, what was the name of that movie? Cheaper by the Dozen. She reminds me of the mom on Cheaper by the Dozen. that better? Here, how about I do this?
and then it shows you how to draw the umbrellas and the faces. Sorry for the wiggle. And it shows you how to draw the chins and the hairstyles and the feet. Oh no! <gasps> oh, Yvette, I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. Hugs. Hugs, hugs, hugs. Draw your 1900s hat. Draw your outfit. Well, I am, you know, I. I, I just want to hug you. And remember, they're always in your heart, Yvette. Always. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. So, you know, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and read, read out of this. Um... Okay, I'm going to read this one. Reaching for God's hand in times of loss. Lord, only you can fill the empty places in canyon of sorrow that has been left in our hearts because of losses. I have We have experienced... Oh, I'm sorry, I read that wrong. Lord, only you can fill the empty places in the canyon of sorrow that has been left in our hearts because of losses we have experienced. Thank you that you are the one constant in our lives that can never be lost to us. All else is temporary and changing. I know you, we know you are a good God and your love for us is endless. Help us to cast our whole burden of grief on you and let you carry it even though there will be times when it feels like we can't live through the pain. I know you will sustain us. The people who walked in the darkness have seen a great light. Those who dwelt in the land of the shadow of death, upon them a light has shined. Isaiah 9-2 So I hope, you know, just that little saying helps you out a little bit, Yvette. Um, I try to read it from um, a pr my prayer book every day, and I, I'm I feel for you. I'm just going to do a little bit of silence for a moment. Amen. So, um, so you could do like a moving picture. Look, bicycles. <laughs> I showed you how to make a bicycle. So, I mean, it'd be fun. I could copy these, you know, and put them in a thing. That would be fun. Soda fountains are very popular. You can draw ice cream. Look, isn't that cool? Look at all the dresses. You're welcome, Yvette. We are blessed by you. We are blessed by you for sure. Feathers are great accessory to the 19, 1910. Follows these simple steps to draw a feather. That's pretty cool. You could do that. Just do a curve and then add to it. Way cool. More shoes. A 
that's right. That's right. We are blessed to have fellowship. Look, I can even copy this for my telephone journal if I ever make it. And I want to do a card journal. Wouldn't that be fun? A grizzly bear, the bunny hop. We can do a dancing journal. This would be neat because you could copy this and put it on a page. And then, um, you know, be like a scrapbook. Dry your hats. Makes me want to draw. Oh, look, stamps. Faux stamps. Does it, when you ever get a letter, do you ever cut the stamp out after you get the letter? I do. Look, I could draw a car. There's just so much in this. Look, at you can make a poodle dog skirt. Call your friends up. I made a poodle dog skirt. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That happened to my son. His grandparents on one side died and then the grandparents on the other side died. And then his dog died. And then he, um... Oh, somebody cut something out of here. Huh. I guess it was the hairstyle they wanted. Oh, they colored it. 1980s. Ah, oh, look at this. You can make the skirts. And the shoes changed. <laughs> See, the shoes are now tennis shoes. Instead of high. Oh, look, somebody's drawing their hat. 1980s outfits. Look at tutu and shoes. In the shuttle. My my um niece's um wow look at that total change look at the boots she's wearing army boots <laughs> I know isn't it the coolest book Another car, SUV, cell phone. Yeah, so when the 1990s came and the cell phone came, that's when this book got put in Goodwill. <laughs> right? Fill in the instant photos. There you go. You can look back and pick out your favorite accessories. This will be one to copy and, and um, put in. You know, because it says here, all rights except permit in the U.S. Copyright Act. No part of the publication may be reproduced, distributed, or transmitted in any form by any means or stored in a database to re retrieval system without prior written per permission. Well, I won't. It didn't say anything. 
Oh, it says no, may not be reproduced. But I could write write them it says because it says without prior written p permission of the publisher. Art Press is committed to preservation of environment. Our books are printed in the U.S. and based inks. Certified green printing facility. Oh, you can go to classes at sales at generalpencil.com. Yeah, I love this book. So maybe I should write her a... Um, Write her a letter and ask her if I can make some copies of it with with um, Valerie Laponte, with um, the you know putting her name on it, putting her name on the on the copies. Anyways, I thought that was cool. And look at this. I'm gonna read this book, but. Look, wouldn't that be cool for a mermaid? A mermaid book? I'm going to read it first. That's pretty. Alright, what, what should we do? What should we do? Oh, let's go back to... Um, this book here. This one. Let's go to this one. Oh, it looks like I have some stuff to put on. I might just leave that in the pocket as, you know, fun stuff. But I have these um, envelopes that I did. There's this one. This one is a foldy one, so I'm going to notice that one. This one, that's a garden one. This one's a floral one. This one is a floral one. Okay, so that one is sealed. I wonder if it's sealed because, no, it's not sealed. Okay. But I think I am going to seal it and then cut it right here. And make it a, a top, a top. Um, no, it'll just be a side one. Well, I don't know. I could do it. I could seal it right here on the edge. I could seal it right here on the edge. I think that's what I'll do. All right. And let's see here. Okay, let's go back. Let's put that there. So. I'm going to just seal this one. I'm just going to use this. Hi, Joyce. Welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. Welcome, welcome. Oh, you cannot chat. Oh, <laughs> you like the roll of TP, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, okay. So My friend gave me a book that we're supposed to do our um, next um, Bible study on. 
And I think it was on the floor here a moment ago, but I don't know where it is now. Uh-oh. I'm going to find it. Got to have it ready for next week. I need a... Oh. I need a... Um... This is what I need. Those are too big. <laughs> yeah, okay. I everybody's probably gonna get them. Poke through the there now it's ready. Oh, forget it. <laughs> I don't have patience for it. And look at that. No wonder it's clogging up. Ding, ding, ling, ding, ding, ling, ding, 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 Oh. Ding, ding, ding. Ding, 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 you want TP sent to us in loads. Okay. We need to hold the paper. Okay. I got to put your addresses on envelope. I'll try to get everybody's addresses printed out. Because I'm going to send everybody happy mail. So make sure you're on our Facebook page and your address is in the um, address thing. And I know, Jade, you have a different name. <laughs> oh. oh, I haven't put it in there yet. I, I have to get the address for the nursing home. So, oh, I put the glue in the wrong spot. All right, forget it. We're just going to glue this closed. I was going to use that, but and then we're just going to cut this up. I'm just going to cut it with these because it needs a fancy cut. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim chimney. Now I need a, a strip of paper. That's long enough. And we're going to fold it like this. Glue it on here. Like that. I should have cut it first. Oh well. I'll just fold it back like this. Then I know where to cut it. Okay, and then 
I'm just going to trim this. Well, actually I'm not. I'm just going to leave that on there. And then we'll open this up. <clears throat> I know. You're babbling, Brooke. I know. You're frozen? Oh, I'm sorry. So it has to go on this side because... Okay. Just listening to myself. Listening to myself and listening to myself. Oh, you mean these toilet paper rolls? <laughs> I'm going to give everybody a toilet paper roll. Carolyn, are you on our Facebook page? If you are on your Facebook, our Facebook page, if you're not... Somebody give Carolyn the link. To our Facebook page. So she can be a part of the Happy Mail thing. Now I see that I didn't decorate this side, so I got to decorate that side. You got somebody share the Facebook page thing on here and make sure you subscribe. Oh, that goes in the fairy garden. That goes in the fairy garden. This one can go. Well, that's a garden, too. Looking for flowers. Oh, that one goes in the fairy garden, too. <laughs> Here, I'll have to cut out that. Oh, that's really cool. That goes in the fairy garden. Oh, man. How pretty is that? Oh, here's the more recipes. Mm. I'm looking, I'm looking. Oh, here's more floral stuff. Let's see here. Okay, that's good. Okay, so I'll put these fairy garden ones back. Because they go in the garden book. Thank you. I got that from Unity Stamps years ago. But Unity Stamps is on Instagram. And they have a lot of really cute stamps. So if you get a chance, go. I think they're also on, um, on Facebook. Scissors. You were frozen. I'm sorry. I think that's garden too. Mm. I keep finding garden ones instead of just floral. But a lot of these are um, plants that are Oh, look at this one. That one's cute, little fairy girl. But she's a, 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 
I'm going to put her in here because she's a flower, a flower um, fairy. A floral fairy. Just cutting off screen. Just cutting up off screen. Oh, I gotta cut this one right. Cutting up off screen. There we go. Oh, well, we'll just put this little one on here. And we have another little one. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim shrew. I hate it when you cut and it like makes like a serrated edge, you know. Aren't these happy flowers? Happy flowers. Just taking the edges off of the off the thing. Facebook page. Facebook page is Friends of Mary Kay Lyons McDonald's Artful Journey. And I was thinking about changing it to K Lyons Artful Journey. <laughs> M K M and then K A Y lines or I mean not like not putting lines McDonald on there. Because I never really wanted that on there in the first place. Well, they laid me off. I get paid until the, the 31st and then they laid me off. <clears throat> Look at chat. Right now I can't afford nothing. I know. I can't afford anything either. But I couldn't afford anything before. So I'm just using my stash. I'm just using my stash. And magazines that I got. I mean, my... It's hard because I want to go to the thrift store. I want to go to the thrift store. I really want to go. I miss going to the thrift store. I'm just going to cry and cry. Oh, thank you. I saw that. I saw that. And you post it again. You're so good. Oh, good. You draw stamps for card making? That's awesome. So for what company do you draw for? Or do you draw for your own company? I saw ya. You were so good. There's a reason that I have you on here. I know that words is sideways, but I don't care. And this is not what I... You know? <laughs> I left a spot down here. Maybe it's for writing a, a word on. I don't know. But I do have this. I have this. 
I could put on the bottom here. This little strip. And I think I'll do, you know, all those seeds that I put in this little terrarium thing? They're dead. <laughs> Poor seeds. Oh my goodness. Oh, I want to cut the edge of that off. Cut it off before. A <laughs> six pack. All right. Hey, that's a good idea. I'll just stamp them. You guys can cut them out. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. All right. I feel like I should stop what I'm doing and just start stamping TP rolls. So this is a little sticker making machine. Oh no. Stay straight. There we go. Great for magazine pages. I'm just going to cut it. I'm going to do it from there and cut it right there. No, I'm going to do it this way because this is prettier. So I'm going to cut it right there. Scissors. My husband's still working too. Washi tape. This is a way you make your own washi tape too. Oh no. Oh, that goes over here. This will go on here. Oh, I don't care. There we go. You know what? You know what I'm going to do? I am going to take the rest of these the rest of these and I am going to <coughs> excuse me I'm going to put them in here. Well, no, I'm not. I thought I had one that was open. I do. It's down here. Where's it at? Here we go. So this one is open. Open, open, open. And then what I'm going to do is... This one has a pocket in it already, so I am just going to tuck it behind here. And then it's in there. And I'm going to come back to it. And then, what I'm going to do is, you know what? Everybody, it's already been an hour. So what I am going to do is sign off on this one and then I'm going to do a few things and stamp some toilet paper rolls. Let me, I'll show you what it looks like. I, I gotta figure out, oh, there it is. So, 
this is the company that the toilet paper roll is from. Let me see. This is the company. Unity Stamps. Itty Bitty by Unity is the name of the stamps company. So go on um, Facebook or um, Instagram because I just saw a thing on their Instagram channel and they have some really great um, stamps. They have a whole bunch of different stamps in there. So, I mean, like this key one is also from them as well. Or, I guess. So, you know, the key one. And then, of course, the... And then this one says, does anybody want this one? It says, sorry you had a... Your, or, sorry your day was so crappy. And then this one says... Excuse my French. That's what it says. And then this one says... Oh, let me see. I'll stamp it. I'll just stamp them all so you can see them better. Do, 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 do. Something white, something white, something white. And these already have the foam on them, so you don't have to have a foam platform underneath them, which is nice. Okay, so this one says, that's how we roll. Sorry, it's upside down. And sorry your day was so... You can read that word. You like that, Mary Lou? <laughs> I know. Well, what I can do... I can come back in about... Um, let me Give me an hour to do all the things I need to do. And then I'll come back. How about that? I'll come back at 11.30. Does that sound like a plan? And we'll play some more. You want to... <laughs> All right. Because I got to go find some paper and um, stamp these, you know. So I gotta find go find some paper to stamp them on. I think I have some white cardstock, but I'm not sure. If not, they might just be on typing paper. So I gotta go get that and all that stuff too. Thank you, ladies, for playing with me this morning, and I will see you in an hour. 11:30. See you guys later. <laughs> Have a blessed day.